for real this time. This is a VR review. We're going to go in. It's Venture 2 Season 1, but it's made in UEFN. So it's a fully new map. It looks like this has some some locations from the old one, but it, most of them, if not all of them, are new. Like, I know Faulty Frontier and Classy Condos, which are two places, and Flannel Forest. All three of those, I do know, I think, were in the old Venture 2. But in the new Venture 2, there is um, there's spawn visibility. Ooh, you hear that? You hear that noise? Okay, get ready to drop. Okay, already way too long. But we can really get a good look at this because this looks really nice. Render distance is a little bit issue for me, but you know. Apparently there are some storm issues and um, just some like little things. But look at this. This is a fully new experience. And this biome, I want to go check this out first. Flannel Forest. Let's go to fan Flannel Forest. That is the place. I think that's the name. I do have a. Um, I might. I think I might have the. Ma I have the map up in, on Twitter right here. So I can just look at stream as well. But we're going to Flannel Forest in this place. So one thing I already saw. Look at that. Discovered POI. So it just you discover POIs and it has this sort of like it has like a name. It like it looks really nice. And this is a. I'm guessing a autumn biome. I'm just just going by how everything looked. It probably is a biome, autumn biome already. Jackus, you did fucking great on this, and I'm being honest. It looks great. It looks good. I don't know what this is. This looks like a volcano. I think Epic Deal still needs to fix some of the bugs with like the mini map in UEFN. I'm hoping they'll fix that in the next few updates. So Jackus still has his um, chest. Not it's not normal chest. He still does this with the chest. I don't know why, but, you know, do what you want. I don't know if there's a new loop pool, if it's the same loop pool. I'm not really going to be ranking off loop pool since I don't entirely know it yet. I don't know if it's in Swan Island, but, again, this map looks so good already. I'm loving the vibes of it. This autumn biome, I actually kind of like it in a little bit more than the Chapter 4 autumn. Because it just, it, I don't know, it really, if, it really gives you that autumn feel. And also, there's these some capture points. Well, technically, yeah, Chapter 4 is medieval <laughs> so you see the look at some of the grass change and stuff just the grass looks amazing already better than the original snapshot adventure already so much better i don't know what that is i loaded into a public game it was already going on i didn't want to check this out in a public game i want to go in here oh this is breakable but look at this this is cool this is something i kind of like Look at this. It's, it's a capture zone, but the way he made it was really cool. It looks custom. It's like a purple capture zone, and he made this little thing here. You can't break it, which is um, probably for the better. You can't break it. Look, it says that on the bottom. Devin actually has captured Flannel Forest. That's cool. An actual capture zone that <laughs> literally works. And also, there are key places that I don't know if they show on the map because I mean you can't really actually well they probably can't show on the map but you know but oh, look at this man but yeah it looks so good I surprised that new map though so benefit of that it is like literally a new map are we gonna go up wait am I just like swimming down here what uh what um what can you just go under here? Is this supposed to happen? Island augment. Oh, you guys still got augments. Island augments. What the f? Okay, this is cool. <gasps> Ooh, this this thing is back. Okay, so if I do this, it looks like I'm in the water. When I do this, I'm not in the water. What? Oh, uh, Jackus, I think there's something. <laughs> a little bit of a overcharge high ground. What's overcharge? I want to see what high ground does. Glad to deploy. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I love that. Okay, so there's some rocks here. What, bruh? Okay, Jackus. Got a little issue here with the water. I'm not stuck. Just, that's not even creative yet. Oh, there's another POI over here. The towers. See, so, yeah, the render distance is a little bit of an issue. You can see, like, kind of where the chests are from pretty far, actually, which is kind of crazy. You can see how where they are. Oh. Vernon Valley. I love that, by the way. Jack, it's good job on the sound design and all that. The sound is amazing. I love all the... I just love it, okay? I love it. I love it. But, um... Oh, that's a drivable vehicle. Oh, okay. 
surprised I haven't seen many memory issues because this is a pretty big map. It's bigger than the other one. Oh, using the glass, especially some broken glass. I'm loving the vibes over here. I'm loving the vibes. For some reason, I'm like kind of liking the vibes over here. Jack has really put his time into this. I can tell. Like, he usually puts his time with everything. What? Never mind. <laughs> no, no, seriously, seriously. He really does put his time and stuff. But I just feel like this, he was like, okay, I feel like this one. This map is different. First UEFN project. For a first, usually people's first UEFN project might not be very good, but this is like. For his first time using UEFN to make like a project like this already after launch, after like the launch only a few months ago, it's pretty ambitious. Like that's pretty hard to do, so I give him that. I don't like how this building is so freaking weird to go through. I want to try to find all the POIs, discover all of them, yeah, but it is hard to find all of them. And how did I just glitch through that? Is that a glitch or is there just like a hole there? Wait, hold up. Is there a hole? Give me that. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, how do I even fit through that? <laughs> Plunger pals. <laughs> Plunger pals. This is a tall ass building. I like the feel of this building. It feels similar. It, this is a weird building. It feels so similar. It feels like I've been here before. In real life. I don't know. It, that's just... Maybe I'm going crazy, but I don't know. Oh, there's a storm. I forgot about that. I want to see what that is. That looks like a volcano. It's going to take a while to get there, so we might need some transportation. Wow, there's actually... All of them are all cars. Jesus. That's pretty fucking cool. I don't know, what's that shop thing? Is that like, because I have a key? I do have a key, so maybe that's what that is. Unbreakable Rose. Cool. Oh, the vending machine for, what the fuck? Okay, well, why the hell would I spend that, Jack is? <laughs> Jack is, why would the hell would I spend anything on that? I don't think that's good. Ooh, that's a cool way to use the zip line. I've never seen that before. I mean, seriously, what the frick? That's cool. What's what that kind of design of a zip line is this? What what is that? That's cool. I like I don't know why I'm like liking the zip lines a lot like this. I'll go capture the zone in a little bit, but look at that, you can just go on the oh. Oh, okay, never mind. Go up here. This is how you get up here, and then you can just go on the other one. To the other That's weird render. The wavy rivers. Let's try the wavy rivers out. They work nice. Wait, I'm, I'm traveling up. How does that make any sense? I'm traveling up. And then there's like a little like freaking thing over here. Loophole, but it's good. Whatever it is, it's pretty good. Other than Thunder. So Thunder Shock is not terrible, but I just don't really like it. Hey man, do you do you? You. Zip lines be traveling through the whole map. And what the fuck? What is this place, bro? And oh my god. Oh, just a spire, spire tower. I don't know what that's supposed to be for. <laughs> we go check Twitter just like to see. So I've discovered Vernon Valley. Sturdy Supply. That's Sturdy Supply. That, that, it's called Sturdy Supply. And there's also a place called Basalt Bay and Research Reef. All of them really close together. This is like, this is a weird, what the fuck? What is this? This is sick. I like this place. I like this little, uh, place. This is a nice, what is this? What? Oh my god. This must have been a volcano at some point, but not anymore. Yeah, definitely not anymore. Okay, I can't build down here. Can I build up here? Okay, I can build up here. That is so weird. That is such a weird place. All right, let me go back because we are gonna die to storm if we don't. Oh, there's risky reels. Uh, discover POI. Oh, look, it's a, it's a blue shopping cart this time. So does that, does that mean it has blue loot? Ah, oh, that's pretty clever, eh? So with this one, this one is. Uh huh. That's cool. So different places have different stuff. Are all these cars drivable? Holy shit! How did you have memory for that? How does this man have the memory for this? I guess this is probably this is probably all we're gonna see in this um in this part of the map. So I'll see you once we're in loving it. Blossom Bluffs. We got some we got some geysers over here. All right, liking the geysers, liking the feel. 
feel this place these locations one thing they are tiny I th they they feel very tiny like tiny locations in a big space usually I wouldn't like that but I feel like the terrain kind of helped the new terrain the way it's just not flat kind of helps with that Back in the grill. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, I was just singing that song. Alright. <laughs> I want to see these trees. These are some nice trees. I think, I don't know how he did that. I don't, I mean, I've seen other people do this too. Like, where they've had the trees. And they've able to, been able to change the color. But I've only seen it in UEFM maps. So, maybe it's not a feature you can do yet. When you destroy it, it's still green. Oh no, that's that one was pink. That was an actual pink tree. Okay, well that that's weird. I I don't understand. Blossom bluffs discovered. Oh, <laughs> I discover I, I I discover the POIs and I also discover random little glitches that I don't really care about, like Z fighting. Don't worry, I have Z fighting too. I hate it. I don't like Z fighting. It's annoying. Can you even destroy? It? I don't understand why well, you can't destroy nothing. <laughs> Give me this. Oh, it's a purple shopping cart, so you got purple loot. That feels like an advantage to just landing at better POIs then. You know? It's like, might as well just land at another POI. I feel like there is a little bit of a lack of brick around the map. I mean, well, actually not totally, but... I kind of felt like that a little bit. Also, you see something there. This is purple. These, like, are purple. So, do you think I'm getting a purple loot? Maybe I'll get purple loot from this capture zone. Because the other capture zone, um, I got green loot. I got, like, one purple gun and some green loot. Maybe this one's different. I don't know. Oh, no, it's the same. Like, relatively the same. What do I do with these keys? Okay, I know. I saw in the trailer you can buy stuff. In the trailer for the map, I saw you can buy stuff. I don't know. This map has a lot of high places. It makes the map feel very big. It, it, it's good. But it may be a little... Maybe these places I think are a little bit too high. It can, maybe it could bring way too much of an advantage to other people that get to those high places. Because I think they could just stay there, you know? So that's the only, like, big complaint I have about this map. It's really just a... I like the high places. It's just that... they like the, I like them because they bring character to the map and they make it look a lot cooler. And they do make it look a lot bigger. A little bit more personality in it. But. It's just that. I think it is just very freaking big. <laughs> it is just a big map. This is a big map. It's it's massive. It's freaking massive. It is literally so big. Double tap. Quick recovery. Double jump enabled? Wait, it said double tap or double jump enabled. I'm double tapping. Grand grind. It's a castle with grind rails. I haven't looked inside these places much, but the thing is, it's like, there's a lot of new, like, I was thinking, like, oh, he's probably going to take the other, the old, the map that's already out now with, um, and just like change the POIs a little bit and just add the terrain. No, he like added full on new POIs. I love that there's like loot on the grind rails. It is weird, man. There's just loot on the grind rails. I mean, not any good loot I got. Oh my god, this is crazy. What the frick? What the hell? Okay, I kind of like this place already. This place is ridiculous and it has a lot of crazy stuff. I'm gonna go inside. Where does it? Nothing. Nothing's in here. Oh, no, there is actually an entire place in here. Oh. The more you know. There is another place called Fa Fa um, Faulty Frontier, which was in the other map. I'm just going to go check that out because, again, I don't know how much time I have until Storm comes. But I do have my mist. So we're going to go. I'm, I'm really just trying to see every single POI. You do you. If you want the thunder, you keep the thunder. People want the thunder, they keep the thunder, you know. You can do that if you want to, but it's okay. All right. Is this faulty frontiers? Oh, there's a uh, mushrooms. Uh huh. Wait, wait. How do you get these? Oh shit. <laughs> I'm an idiot. 
How do you get these mushrooms? Look at this. What the frick? These are the... You know these mushrooms, are, they're from the... Um, chapter Jesus Christ, I'm gonna die. Can I get up here? Fine. Damn. So these are the mushrooms... These are the mushrooms from... Um, from Chapter 2, Season 4. Remember when they changed the mushroom biome into that, like, autumn biome? Yeah, this is basically the that. How do you get those? Also, these are taking forever to heal you. These suck. <laughs> these are not good healers. Oh, uh, there's Faulty Frontier. I mean, that doesn't look like the old Faulty Frontier I'm used to. Again, it's a very small POI. It's small. The shopping cart over there. You know what that means? Big loot. Big big money loot. Big man big money man loot. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Storm doesn't seem too bad. We can explore a little bit because we're not making it to any other POI. Because we are dead. It's about to be a long ass video. I love the. Oh, oh, there we Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I was like, Faulty Frontier, where's the rest of the POI? And I was like, oh, it's over here. The fault lines, remember? It's so it's kind of like the, um, you know. Fuck, I forgot. So it's weird. This place has like two shopping carts. Oh, look at that. New saddler finding homes near you. What the fr- Is this like. We'll sue anybody. Oh my god, what the fuck? We'll sue anybody. Bro, what are you... Okay. Why am I even healing? I, I guess might as well just check out this place. Because this is a fun little POI. Full of fun little things. To do. You can go, f you can go shopping. See what else you can do here. You can... Get gas. You can capture something. I mean, if you're into that. This is remind me of Faulty Split. Faulty Splits is a very is a POI that a lot of people like recreating in mini BRs. So you know what I just realized? This place, this Faulty Frontiers place has two shopping carts in it. One of them was legendary with legendary loot, and one of them is green with um uncommon loot. So this POI just like two different POI just put into one because of how I mean I was kinda like weird. I was like kinda surprised. All right, heading down to Basalt Bay. Love the um, sound you have for discovering POIs. Is this chapter one? Oh, the chapter one tree, desert trees. I saw this in the trailer for it as well, I think. I think this was in the trailer. Oh, you can just show the bottom. Oh, okay. Are you supposed to be able to do that? I guess. I guess you are, but okay. <laughs> give me some loot. Give me some loot. Give me, give, give, give me some loot. I want to get that glider augment next time because I just, I kind of need it. Yeah, I'm getting trash right now. This place is nice. It doesn't have any boats. Ooh, but look at that little island over there. That's cute. Cute little island. I've been saying cute a lot, but again, it's a, it's a nice little POI. And this also reminds me of that little ship. Remember in Chapter 2 and 3? I remember in Chapter 3, they just kept it. Because like, everybody loved that ship. It just had, like, loot on it. Everything. It was really nice. They came in Chapter 2, Season 3, the best season, in my opinion. But, you know... It has good stuff and stuff and stuff and stuff and stuff and stuff. I love how it's just not even connected to anything. Like it's just it's just floating. Uh, two chests right here. Damn. You don't have to search it anymore. I don't remember. I feel like you did at some point have to search it. I am finding um the same loot, so I think I can kind of make a rough idea of what the loot hole is. But, you know, I, I, entire, not, not entire travel in this map. And this map only has 50, this is like 50 players. This is a pretty big map. I feel like this map could, 
It probably can't support 60 players, but I feel like this is a 60 player map. In my opinion, I think it's a 60 player map. Locations are pretty small, but there's just, like things around. I, oh, you know what? That's probably why. Because the locations are pretty small. So I think 50 maybe. You're going to have people. Then you're going to just have people everywhere. And you're not going to be able to get any like er, anything at early game. Like early game kills are going to be pretty harder to do and stuff. Oh, sturdy supply. <laughs> oh, the key. The key. I, I, I don't have a key though. That key thing. I found one. Yup, over here. So this is, look at that. Look at this cool ass design. Oh, I'm destroying it now. I'm destroying this design because I'm a piece of shit. So this key required, you need one key for all these. Uh, some good, some good stuff. You get a rocket launcher? Oh, sick. I'm going to get that. <laughs> all right. So, um, oh, I can't even get it. All right, whatever. All right, so I'm a so while I'm to this, I didn't go. I didn't check out Sturdy Supply because I've already. I've already seen it. What's that music? Oh my god! Hey, what the fuck? Yo, we got the music. Oh, sorry. High ground. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. That is so fire, dude. That is loud, bro. That was freaking loud. I don't want to see it. Bro, damn, I can still hear that. Bro, Jesus, that is freaking loud, Jackus. That's not even Jackus' issue. I'm just trying to make it an issue for him. Eh, eh, eh. I'm evil. <laughs> Frantic Fields, here I come. I'm going to go to Frantic Fields because you know what? I'm that guy. Yo, that is too loud. Fashion, faction. An obvious Jackus fashion. There is a, um, there's, um, Searing Stacks, which is also the Stacks place. I don't know what is this with him. He loves the, that place with the Stacks and also, oh, you can hide. There's probably a secret base somewhere. Just guessing. Frantic Fields. Am I here now or am I not here yet? I don't know. Frantic Fields. This is a nice little homely place. It's nice and homely. Pretty spread out, but still nice. It's like the it's like the beginning. Um, I feel like the, I can see this place in the. Uh, I can actually see this place in the um. The autumn biome, but it's per. I guess it's not. Uh, this uh, I'll be honest. This map is really well made, and I love the um autumn stuff. Cause there was an autumn biome. I think in this other map, or what? Or, or it was jungle. I don't know. Damn, I still got the sound. Hey, captured the POI and everything. I still have the sound? Oh my god. Yo, oh my god. There's like a really bad pain in my, in my arm, bro. Alright, I'm gonna try to just get this done because I'm kind of in pain right now. Ugh. I actually might be able to see all the locations. I've basically seen every single one except for one, but you know what I mean. It's, sometimes we get to cut. Cut. Sometimes we have to cut edges and not edge cut. You know what I mean. Bro, that is so loud. Well, actually, it's not as loud as it was, but it's still bad. Is this classy condos? Wow, damn, we're already here. Yeah, the thing is, the place... Oh, it's just kind of like how it was. Again, place is big... But for some reason, it feels like tiny. It's big, but it feels tiny. Oh, look at this. You can get one of this. Uh, I don't really need anything from here. I'll purchase that. Thank you. That just purchase two guns? Bro, you can purchase two guns if you have one key. <laughs> Maybe I had two keys and I'm tripping, but I'm pretty sure I had one. Break in here. Classy. Again, I'm looking at this place just... What I'm doing for this ranking, I'm looking at the surroundings. What 
over here, vehicles, and also look at these islands. Just the the feel of the map. The feel of the map is great. I mean, other than the sound that's fucking annoying. It's great. Um, Searing stacks. We're at the last POI we have to discover. So basically, we are done. But, like, look. This, mo this man, Jackus, has to add a, like, steamy stacks type POI every single freaking map he does. And, oh. That's lava. That that is that is lava. That is actually lava. Wow. I didn't even know you could destroy that. You gotta add a little problematic there. I think I'm a I think that you have to add a problematic there. That's gonna be a little problem problematic. See what I did there? That's pretty funny. I'm funny. See what I did there with the um, problematic problem problematic? Okay. Can you fly? Can you just if this shit don't shut the fuck? I don't know. I don't, should I rate now? Oh my god. Oh, there's keys. At, like, okay, there's like keys at like every POI then. I guess I missed a lot of them. I, there must be keys at every POI. I might have missed all of them. Brick from a crate? Oh. Didn't even know you could get brick from a crate. But you know what? Who do you? This map could probably be actually creepy at night. I can't even lie. It, this map could be pretty creepy at night, but really nice and bright at, in the daytime. That's what I'm feeling about it. Like I, can, I love how I can, I can just see the the terrain just keep going up around the ends of the map. It looks so nice. Oh, sorry. It looks so nice. And one thing, there isn't enough rivers, but like rivers are very hard to make. Actually, there's like, actually, what am I talking about? There's a lot of rivers, right? There's a nice amount of rivers around where there's like faulty frontier and like supply, sorry, supply research. I didn't check out Research Reef, but. You can go do that yourself. I'm not doing that. <laughs> it hurts. Uh huh. Uh, Man, I like this map, and um, actually, I love it. Not, I don't like it. I love it. So um, I'm gonna rate it. I'm gonna rate it a nine. I'm gonna rate it a nine because there are still a lot of glitches that are on Epic side that need to be fixed, and also there are some little like random. There's some like random little things. I think that we need a little bit more ways to travel through the map i feel like there just isn't enough like this over here like that also that water bug when i was just kind of under the map with the water i think that needs a little bit of a fix because i can literally see some parts of that you're not supposed to see but i do love the poi the terrain is amazing it's the terrain is like the best i've seen in uh, any map at this point i'm being serious about that i feel like the terrain Using 2.0 is the best I've seen in any POI to this point. Oh, POI. Any map at this point. Shut up. Yeah, this is the best terrain I've seen in any map at this point. And um, despite the storm glitches and the, the fact that I can't really see that far, I do like it. I still love. I still like the uh, normal chest thing, but I'm starting to get used to the way Jackus does the chest. Could be a little bit more rocks, and there are some little patches of things that don't have like trees and stuff. But that could be because because of a lot of memory. That, that could be a thing. And also things like the water. I, I see that a big problem in the map a lot with maps all the time is water. That there's a big problem with it. It is like kind of hard to make. Like water is a really hard thing to you do in Fortnite because it's like really it's really weird. The way everything is, is just super duper 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 weird. It's such a new system where, it, I mean, I think it honestly still needs time to grow. And we're giving it that, we're giving the um, UEFN this time to grow, but for now, this is the, right now, this is the best UEFN. Right now, I don't really know my favorite VR map. From, I, my favorite BR map that isn't made of UEFN is still AG Battlegrounds. Amazing. But my favorite UEFN made map is this one. It's great. It, and I'm surprised. I'm really surprised from Jackus. This is probably his best project yet. It's a big map. Only thing it needs is some glitches to be fixed. Some glitches to be um, massively fixed. And like... Also, whatever that sound bug is... And the, um, you know, I mean, he's already working on fixing some stuff. So, I'm going to give him a break. Probably been working hard for these two, probably been working for these, really hard for these two months. 
But um, great job, Jackus. If you ever end ever end up seeing this video, um, I can't wait to see what you have for the next seasons. And also, tell me if you can get custom biomes on like Sketchfab or something. Like, I want to know if, like, if I ever go on if I ever go on the um, UEFN journey, then I might want to know because I don't know yet. And I I know there is a way. To um get custom biomes, because I've seen someone else use like galaxy have a galaxy biome in their map. I don't know what biome this is. I'm pretty sure this is already just from. I think this is already from like creative, like creative biome made. I know they're working on bringing the jungle biome in, but for now, I think this map is great, and I don't think it needs too many changes right now. I think it's it's looking good, real. It's looking real good. Yeah, so my final rating is a 9 out of 10. Just some real minor fixes. It could be an easy, easy 10 out of 10 map. Honestly, really, I, if if I wanted to be more particular, I would rate it a 9.2. But yeah, for me, this map is a 9 out of 10. So, I hope you, I hope you enjoyed the rating and just checking out and another amazing map by Jackus. And this is one of his best, if not his best, so far. I am going to die to storm. That's all right. Okay, you can stop moving now. Oh, Jesus Christ, the storm! Oh my God, the storm is all fast. Jesus. All right, that was barely a save, but all right. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.